we already recording right now so yo what's going on um i would say that i appreciate y'all coming through uh people had to do other things the other day that we were scheduled so that's a little, a little that's, busy, little it, busy. It, it, it's a little, little busy so no no problems no problems with that so but y'all y'all made it back got one of my um close brethren's uh town and then uh we got we got our nephew popping um our mom um uh, how you how you do, man? Or am I going with you first? How you doing, man? Oh man, uh, I'm doing great. So uh, literally, literally just got back from Thailand about a week ago. Um, going into my senior year of college, majoring in marketing and finance. Uh, about to graduate. Uh, it's, it's getting it's, June, it's right? getting real. May May fifteenth. Oh, May, oh, May, oh well, yeah. Yeah. So we, we, we got something in the works potentially. Oh yeah, for sure. Uh, mid, I ain't mid, even tell him. Oh yeah, shit! Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I didn't blow it. Yo 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 yeah, that was I told I you that was I ain't talked to nobody about that, I nigga. Know, I talked to you. Well, now, well, now, well, now. Guess what? We talking about it right now. So, <laughs> so now, so now, now was now was in the now we gonna make it. Happen. It's, it's, you know what I'm saying? So we gonna make it happen. You know what I mean? For sure. Damn, I'm, I, I, yeah. I, 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 I probably probably yeah, me. I was gonna pack me and JoJo was gonna come down there with the truck because you gotta move back up. Ooh. Yeah, so that was gonna be the vibe. That was well, yeah, not gonna that's, be. That's now, now, now is now is going. That, that, that's, that's, like, that's the vibe. <laughs> that's the vibe right there. Now, yeah. now that was going. That was gonna be, man. Oh, that's damn. Definitely, my bad, definitely. My bad, Tony. I told you I'm solid, nigga. <laughs> I, know, I, know, I, know. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't. I didn't know. I didn't know. I didn't. Oh fuck. That, no hey. stress. No stress. Well, with that being said, hey Tom, how you do, but man, I can't complain, man. Better than I deserve, nigga. For real. <laughs> Say it. Real shit. Hey, that, that, that's the thing. So. Even with that said, I mean, I'm I'm good money. I I've been recording all day actually and stuff. But um, but like no, I I, re- I really want to take the time and um, just just seeing just seeing you are mine and seeing um, just just being around y'all for these last couple of years and and just seeing your growth and seeing just not even growth because you like like you was a bad kid, but just um, just seeing what you've been doing as an adult and going forward and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, it, it's, it's, it's very dope to me, and I know it's dope to him, but he, he'll be able to speak on his own. Um, so I, I, will, I will ask you, and, you know, we got the paper prep. Um, what, 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 what do this man to your left, um, what, what do he mean to you, or, or what, what, what have you learned from this, from, this, from this gentleman to your left that, um, is, that inspired you or doing what you're kind of doing now or outside of that spectrum? Definitely, definitely. Uh, thanks for asking that question. And um, honestly, like you know, this this guy I already know, but you feel me? I, I call him my uncle dad. Yeah, exactly. Because uh, <clears throat> you know, he was he was he's been that father figure for me throughout yes. my life. Uh, growing up, uh, you know, my mom was young, had me really young, and my father wasn't there. Uh, you know, they were both young, so I really don't at fault him for that because I could only imagine how it would be being 15, 16 years old with a child with right. a couple children. Uh, I couldn't imagine it myself, but. Uh, you know, this guy right here, he, he took the initiative to actually start raising me at the age of 18 uh, when my mom got in a bit of legal problem. Yes, sir. Um, and, you know, just just that, uh, had, it's inspired me uh, throughout the course of me, like, being in college and looking back, like, man, when I was 18, I was going to college, you feel me? When, when right. he was 18, he was raising raising a whole a whole child. So uh, it's, it's beyond respect there because uh, cause I, I see the sacrifices he's made for me. Um uh, but honestly, he's he's given me the mindset, you know, and I'm extremely appreciative of that. Um, I think everything starts with the mindset, you and know. That, that, that work. So I mean, like, um, I I would say because, like I said, I, I learned because I, I know you started at kid, you started at Kennedy one night, and like you said, you was already in college uh, at a young age. Definitely. So um, so it was, <clears throat> so like even even going to Ken, even going to Kennedy. Oh no, not Kennedy. Oh I, no, I, I did you want, uh, John Hay. John oh, no, 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 excuse me. Yeah, excuse yeah, me, John Hay. John Hay. John Hay. Oh, my, my, my apologies. Um, but. Going to a, a CMSD school, definitely, and you know it, it could be a persona of what that you can make. Some people can make it out, some people can't. But and even even um, touching on the base of you know like moms, you know going through what, what she went through at the definitely, time, being definitely. young and stuff like that. But and even even with your even with your uncle um, going through his struggles, how, 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 he, how he went through it, like for sure, you know for sure, saying? and for him to do that, so. Um, I I really I, I really love I always loved that when, when I first met him then you know we came about we, we all figured out that we Definitely. knew 
each yeah, other in a roundabout from, from way. Connect. You know what absolutely, I'm saying? Like, absolutely. You know, way. So no, nah, but um but I I know the biggest thing, um it, it, it's, it's it's pretty dope just seeing that, you know what I'm saying? Like seeing, sure. seeing that from a from a from an uncle uh standpoint and from, you know, that we talking uncle wise and then you like you said, Uncle Dad. And then uh, um what you telling, you know what I'm saying, like you seeing the success that, that that this young man is doing, what what do you what what do you um what, what, what how did that make you feel? You know what I'm saying? Like this this for seeing that success and just um being able to be a part of that in a, in a in a roundabout way or 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 start it off you know from from when he was a a, a younger C how how did, that, how did that make you feel just seeing how we going right now like man that shit so I don't even know if I can even put that shit in words right because none of this shit was like none of this shit was premeditated like none of this shit was we literally was drifters like for real like didn't know what the fuck was gonna happen from day to day right. so to see that to see him become a man and just kind of take his own wave. And just create the shit and do what he doing now. That shit is just unbelievable. That shit unbelievable. That shit just brings joy to me. Because we got people that still in our immediate circles that had it off better than him. Mm -hmm. And didn't take that right. take that route that he took. Right. And and now we four years later though. Now which we fucking later. 21 years later in yeah. hindsight. <laughs> we 21 sure. years later because you 21. But four years later. You then went to the school and got that shit done expeditiously, and yeah, the shit is just T I word of the day. Yeah, definitely, and it's here though, it's and here. it's everything that we spoke Literally. brought to like brought to life, manifested through words, just manifested through words, manifested that shit. Like I'm telling you, like what the fuck? <laughs> and, and, <laughs> and, crazy. And even with that being said, like I I say with everything, it's 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 about the mindset. You either gonna have a boss man, boss mindset or a bum mindset, you know. Gotcha. And like he he helped instill that within me, the the boss mindset. Like, you know, my guy. Got a felony, no degree. Right. You feel me? But he made. But look where you at, though. Look where you at. You see what I'm saying? Look where you at. Absolutely. And it's about the mindset. You see what I'm saying? Like, I done watched this man work down there 24 hours and go back to work the next day. <laughs> like, like, fuck it. Like, I'm and just, not even get up and complain yeah, about it or nothing. It ain't just, no complaints. Yeah, hate ain't that, no that complaints. shit. Ain't hate no that complaints. shit with this generation. Right. And that's one of the things that was in. Now, mind you, I didn't know I was even instilling anything in him because you don't see the fruits. You don't see the fruits from the fucking tree until they produce themselves. Like, you know what I mean? Like, because right. you could be around like a hundred different people and one person is gravitating off of what you're talking about. Definitely, and they actually, definitely. it's actually being like brought up inside of them. And then when you start to see them form into the person they are, you like, damn, like that motherfucker yeah, that... took some from what I was saying for real. Because right. it was a, it was him. It was William. It was Mike. It was so many other yeah, his friends was, that was all around. You, yeah, yeah. And he was the only one that was retaining that yeah, information retaining and soaking it in and in. and now it shows with his life and it shows with theirs too right. period so, I mean that, that's I mean like and once again you, you know man you always talked on record definitely. and we always talked about it and uh, being happy about it I'm actually in tears and just speaking about it man yeah <laughs> that shit <laughs> crazy. crazy yeah, yeah that shit <sighs> but uh, let me get myself together <laughs> <laughs> my favorite ride but um <laughs> Pretty dope, dog. Like yeah, that's just, it, just, dope just, well. just seeing that man, like yo, that's it's uh, excuse me. Really Go ahead, take shit, a moment, dog. nigga. That you shit real. Saying? Like uh, it's really dope, dog. Um, and, and with that being said, you feel me? It's 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 a blessing for real. You feel me? Because. Literally, like, it's it's crazy. Like, you know, I know we ain't, we ain't at that part of uh, the conversation yet, but I was just in Thailand, you feel me, with four months. Only black guy. Uh, there was an African with me and then two mixed girls. But uh, me being the only, you know, I would say actually, you know, black person who've experienced the African-American culture. Right. You know, it's a blessing seeing myself in these environments because cause we're lacking. You see what I'm saying? Like, I could count on my hand the amount of people, amount of my people that I know with a passport. You see what I'm saying? Real shit. And it's like... At this point, it's like we gotta do better. You feel me? But like, don't get me wait, wrong. Wait, you mean I? You mean I should pay my insurance on this before I pay on my body, right? Fuck no. No, that's what I'm saying. We oh, gotta do better. We gotta, right? uh, we we gotta, gotta do, do better. better. Right? My phone is fully insured, but we gotta do better. Uh, but I ain't got no insurance on my body, so you gotta. What? When I die, y'all figure it out. I, I, I gotta. Uh, I, oh. gotta I gotta do the uh, GoFundMe or whatever. Yeah, y'all figure it out yeah. when yeah. I when I die. What? Yeah, sure. I'm leaving uh. great gifts. Generational wealth. Generational yeah. wealth. What? I, I, Changing. I, the I, dynamics. I, I, I even say, I'm like, yo, y'all, I'm like, even what you were saying, like, as far as death and going forward with that, like, uh, yo, I'm fucking, I'm like, hey, 
We do. We doing straight cremation, man. Look, the minimalist thing. Go ahead and take that little Real shit sick. and do what you got to do. You know what I'm saying? Hundred percent, hundred percent. But uh, but I, I, as you was talking about, uh, uh, my um, yeah, I'm gonna call you back in like ten minutes. So like t- like teaching abroad or, or I'm like, doing this um, little podcast. Like like te- teaching teaching abroad. Or or just even being abroad and hey, I, if he I send put, you the joints, I don't mean to cut you off. If I he put, send you the joints, can you put them up there like some of the pictures and shit? Yo, yeah, yeah, I, 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 I be having. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, you got some? I mean, oh, I mean, I mean off his IG whatever, and shit. Whatever, whatever you have on Facebook. Yeah, that okay, shit, yeah, though. Yeah, 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 that shit is a whole other way. That's how I researched when I was about to talk about right now, like Thailand, South Korea, China. You know what I'm saying? Like being there and then teaching abroad, like definitely. How was how was that? How was that experience? I don't know. I know you just touched on this a little bit just a couple minutes ago before I was crying like a little bitch. <laughs> no Man. stress, no stress. But, uh, <laughs> <laughs> but how? But how did you? Uh, I mean, like, how? How was that being over there and being in that different experience? Like, um, like, this is how, how was it? Just, sure, give me, give sure. me a little, give me a layout. So, uh, what I what I say the most is it was a dream. You feel me? Because like me coming back home, it just felt like I just woke up. You know, like I just like woke up out of a dream. Like it's ninety degrees there. So even with that, like, you know, I come back and it's 30 degrees. Like, it's like, <laughs> shit, like, where the sun at? Like, come on, give it to me. But uh, Tell them how you hit me with the flex, though. One of the, this nigga got, called me or whatever. And that nigga said, now dig this when he said, I could sure tell I'm back in fucking. Oh, man. Kill it. I can, I can damn sure tell I'm back in America. You feel me? Just because the culture is so different, you know? Mm-hmm. So, like, they're like. Literally, one of the one of the common sense is like my pen right. No stress. Don't worry about it. It's okay. So say that part again. Or what was that first? My uh, pen right. My pen right. Yeah. Okay. It's just like it's like Hakuna Matata. Okay. Like, gotcha, it means gotcha. no worries, I, I know no that means stress. Right. I know that. Yeah, for I sure. definitely know that. Definitely. He's like, I got that. Shadow Lion King. I Literally, that. you feel me? Okay. I got you. But uh, you know, I, I get back Simba. in the states. <laughs> man, I love Simba, man. He, he ain't do it when his fault. It was Scar fault. Look, it was Scar fault. Go ahead, man. For sure, for sure. But uh, I get back to the states. I get me uh, go to a little restaurant. Give me a little breakfast sandwich. And uh, there's a guy in front of me. It's literally just me and him. So they messed up his order. He started going off. You feel me? <laughs> he turned up. Y'all mess up my shit. Like, I'm, I'm out of here. Y'all only ain't no customers here. Y'all have one job. Like, he on a, he on him. He on him. So he walked Typical away. Typical Americans. Man. So, so I, you know, I see, <laughs> I, I see the sounds. I'm like, y'all mess up his sounds. Like, can I just have his? Like, you see what I'm saying? Like, Bro, y'all going to throw that motherfucker away shit. anyway. You right, feel right, me? Right, right. So, uh, yeah, they, so they end up giving me my and his, but it was just that little encounter of them in a split second, not only messing up his food, but him extremely going off on him, you know? Because in Thailand, that wouldn't happen. Like, be it, people are it, prone it, to make it, mistakes. It, simple, right? Shit happens. Literally, it just happened. So they like my pen right, like no stress. Like, so and good. on some real, I've never gotten my order wrong there. Like, you see what I'm saying? I've never been somewhere and gotten an incorrect order there. It's crazy. And I was there for four months. You feel yeah. me? Like, it's little stuff like that. And uh, so, while, so, 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 so as you transition, so as you so, so we did Thailand, and then um, is, is it considered the uh, the middle? What, what, what is all this? Considered? It's Southeast Asia. Southeast Asia. There we yeah. go. Okay. So, so now, so now we did Thailand, and we um, what's going on? Oh, oh! Now, now we now we did Thailand. <clears throat> now we did Thailand. So so like so now we move on, and I know it's not there's no particular order or whatnot, but let me let me uh, so give me give me something about but whether whether you you want to say South Korea first or China first? Well, how, how well, you, I actually how, how it, I didn't how did it roll? I only visited South Korea as like a layover. Oh, okay. And then I didn't even go to China. Oh, but okay. I met a oh, bunch oh, of oh, Chinese oh. people. Oh, and, well, I, uh, I, I apologize about that. Oh, yeah, no, no that, stress. That was, no my stress. Mess, uh, that was my misinformation then on myself. Um, but South Korea, you say you just did a layover? Yeah, just a layover. Okay. So I just I was just there for, you know, a couple hours, maybe three, four hours. Okay, uh, well. Yeah, not, not too much. Well, what if, what a fix, what a fix that. Um, we're going to uh, come back to the States. And you already said come back to the States as far as um, being here back in Cleveland. But uh, you did spend time in Chicago, correct? Oh, yeah, for sure. And... But is is that when you was doing a little bit of teaching or or, or, no. or learn or is it teaching or learning? Well, in Chicago, I was doing an internship with JP Morgan. There you go. G- yeah, that, that's, a, that's what I'm at. Yeah, okay. JP, JP. All right, there we go. JP Morgan experience. That's yeah. that's what we going oh, at. Oh man, that's here we go. That's, JP. A, that's a yep. that's a there we that's put a, a price right tag there. on that shit. <laughs> Ooh, wait, that was a that was an experience. But uh, so how, how how did that how did that um I mean like what did you uh what did you potentially I mean other than your knowledge and obviously you're about to be graduating and be doing big things or sure. doing big things. But how did that um that, that experience to to be under that, that big name um for a company? How did that work for you? Yeah. Or how it's working for you so far? Definitely, definitely. So uh it's actually really funny. My whole my whole summer experience was really interesting. Just cause um, you know, I initially really thought that I wanted uh to have a certain opportunity so bad. You know, this was like 
the 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 crip of the crop you know best yes. of the best um majors marketing finance so this is where i thought i, I wanted to be but uh, i got in there and um don't get me wrong opportunity is amazing make make uh, met great people uh you know really enjoyed my time but uh, i just felt there was a little bit uh me under utilizing my talents gotcha. essentially um and and what, what i really learned is the idea that you know only you have your best interests at heart oh, you definitely, know definitely. so don't get me wrong there's people who could put a price tag on your dreams on your situation on what what you have the ability to do but on some real at the end of the day you're the only one who makes those decisions yes you know you the one who decides to sign that contract to say work for 12 bucks an hour you know like right. even if you believe your time is worth more like i, I think we as people we we kind of sell ourselves short and uh even though i was making really solid money i still felt that way what was it was that so that was a pay internship oh if i may very, ask very, yeah when you well, say uh, uh solid money uh throw, throw a number uh, on that are, are, are you saying like k a year or like what, 28 what, 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 what bucks an talking? hour 28 bucks an hour oh, oh okay yeah, oh, so so, so solid, even solid though days. even though so oh so so what you getting at, or if i may try to reintervene and and tell you, you please, can help please. you can help me out with it so you were saying like even though that number was good for most but you feel that Yo, mental and my your, abilities, um, my your talents, abilities my... is 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 worth a little bit more than absolutely, hundred percent, hundred percent. I got you. And so, entrepreneurship yeah, exactly. overall is the key. Being your own boss, being yes. your own boss. Period. 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 And, and, period. and, 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 and even going with that, because you know, you know, Dame Dash, um, Dame Dash really um stands strong on like being your own boss. But that nigga's but, a weirdo. Oh, well, I mean, well, I, 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 I'm, I'm trying to say this in a positive. <laughs> no, aspect I get you. Right, I won't take but, his ass so, out so, today. So, but no, 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 I'll catch his wave because I'm trying to keep it positive. With, the, with, with with our youngin, but um, what, what I was what I was saying with that, like it was like, yo, you be your own boss, <clears throat> you be your own boss, and aspects where everybody can't be a boss. Like you, you need mm. the workers or whatnot, in some things or whatever. Like I can't be the boss of the right. say I work at the VA. I can't. It's like I only I only work part time. Right. Know I mean? For sure. So and and I only make X amount of number, whatever whatever case may be, and but but that, see that, that, that's not my. I mean, I mean, like I have to work for somebody else. Absolutely, to make but good. Could I, could I hop in on that real no, quick? No, no, go, go ahead. Even though I completely, I completely see what you're saying. But what makes you, what separates you from most other people? You're still taking your, your, your time, your energy, and putting it towards something you actually enjoy. You feel oh, me? This okay, podcast. Okay, you see okay, what I'm saying? Okay, you're gotcha, like, gotcha. you're bossing up, and you're like, I'm taking my own time back by doing something I enjoy. Gotcha. Most people, they they hit their nine to five. They get off, they watch Netflix, they eat and they go to sleep and they start right. the same thing over and over. They're, they're doing nothing to really... Enhance their portfolio in it. life. In life. If you ever lost your job, where would you be without that? Who Literally. are you, who without, are you your without your job? Without your job. Let's go. <laughs> Real shit. Who are you? you know? I, I love y'all. Who are you? You got that golden <laughs> arch on your shirt. Who are you? <laughs> who are you? And, 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 and the shit crazy because like I, I, as you said that, like you know, I mean, like even though I do, I do indulge in my Netflix. Nigga. Oh, for we, we sure, same, same, same. We but, can look, but, uh, but like, but like, yo, I ain't even played. Like, uh, I had Call of Duty since the day it came out, and I've been like almost two months now, and I haven't played with it because yeah. I've been, because I've been, I've I been mean, not messing around, but I've been, been focusing on this, Absolutely. You know, other than work, and, as you, know, you yeah, should. Yeah, I've been focusing on this, and you know, like, like I said, like, hey, as y'all look at y'all papers or whatever, I got, I, I do yeah. so much yeah. doing it. it even, even, even the due diligence, it's prep, yeah, it, it's it, prep. It, exactly, I'm, I'm doing pre-prep all through the week, and then, and it is, it's not, it's not just me. I mean, like, <clears throat> even my brother-in-law, you know, what I'm saying stuff like that, like, um, as far as that, but. I, I I have to do certain, you know, what I'm saying like it, it's a lot of the stuff that I be having to do behind the scenes, the the editing sure. and all that stuff. So I I do I do understand what you're saying as far as as far as that. Um, another thing I have for you, um, <clears throat> what make you who you are? Oh, we. Uh, so so one thing I say I say uh, what? Yeah, you can say me. I say adversity is my superpower. Mm -hmm. Uh, my my headphones kind of. No, you go, oh, just, just plug it in your, your left side. Cause I, I, okay, okay. I, I heard the same thing. Bet. Oh no, I heard you. No, you, you good, you good. Okay, I, okay, I, I, okay, I for you, sure. But uh, what I say, I say adversity is my superpower. Uh, that's that's something I start saying uh, a couple couple years back. But it's just the idea that you know all my hardship is essentially who, who what what makes me. I say uh you know hardship builds character. Yes. And you know, I tell a lot of people like when I was abroad, you know, I was I was meeting so many people, having so many interactions, so many experiences, and it was absolutely beautiful. But you know, people would ask me like, you know, how how old are you? And uh, I would guess, like you see, what I'm saying, I hit them with a guess, because mm -hmm. most people are like, 
they're mind blown to think that I'm 21. You see what yeah. I'm saying? So they're like 26, 27. And I'm like, no, like I'm 21. They're like, what? Like right. they can't believe it. You know, I tell them, like, you know, adversity builds character. You know, like even even about like people in Thailand, what I say, I, I believe that Thai people grew up a lot slower than uh, African Americans, uh, Americans as well. Uh, just because I feel like in America you have. America's like dog eat dog, you know. It's it's a lot yeah. more problems, difficulties, especially cut if you come cut from cutthroat and everything cut like that. Absolutely. Especially the, the atmosphere that, that we potentially right. been around. Yeah, literally, you know especially if you come from the hood, you know. Right, right, right. But in, in Thai, a lot of people are sheltered, so they're like, they're really sheltered. Like I was teaching monks, and uh, for a portion, I was teaching monks, and I was teaching abroad, correct? Yeah, so, this so is when I was abroad. Right, cool, cool, yeah, cool, yeah, cool. yeah. I was, abroad, I was, okay. I was studying and teaching abroad. So uh, while I was abroad, I'm, I'm teaching these monks, and I asked um, my, I asked a teaching assistant, like, "Hey, bro, how old are, how old is my class?" And he's like, 24, 25. And I was mind blown because when I say I felt like these guys were acting like, like high school students, like these guys, even though they're monks, they're like, they're joking around, they're like sending and notes, they're, they're giggly, laughing, they're giggly, and giggly, and yeah, and giggly. literally, literally. <laughs> so it was like I was mind blown that these guys are 25, 26, you know. And then he asked me, like, "How old are you?" And I'm like, 21. He's like, "What?" Like he was. He couldn't believe it, you know? But uh, what I tell people is adversity, you know? Like, adversity builds character. The more hardship that you faced, you, you, you're forced to grow up a lot faster than uh, a lot of people, a lot of people. And I believe that that was my situation. And, <coughs> uh, you know, diamond diamond either going to create coal or it's going to... What? Pressure is going to either create diamond like or coals, you know? Pressure, yeah. And I'm, I'm a diamond, but I've definitely seen a lot of people turn to coal, you know? You def you're definitely a diamond. And even on the flip side, you saying like some turn to cold or so, excuse me, some turn to cold and stuff like that. Uh, Tony, you got got anything on uh, just, just to talk about that aspect or, I mean, like as far as I like, mean, we always you know, knew we always you know, knew that like pressure and adversity definitely it molds a different type of person. Yes, you know what I mean. And we always say in order to be a blessing to somebody else, you gotta lose sight of yourself. You have to lose sight of yourself. <laughs> Look at you. Period. Yeah, period. Like so. With that being said, a lot of people. And and this this is the shit that we always sit back at the table and look at each other and we had a fucked up like I remember nigga me and Armand would be sitting there with four nice pairs of boxers looking at each other like can I wear the red polos <laughs> one day and you would wear the blue ones and then we would watch them and we'd go back and forth real shit and the niggas that was around us mothers would had was STNAs job nurses nigga and was had giving these niggas the best lives New Jordans every fucking. Every time the shoes drop. On demand, drop, motherfucker. On demand, and me and him swapping out shoes. He'd wear them to school one day, and I'll wear them out to a bit with, uh, with a bitch to the movies the next day. Right. So it just kind of changed the character aspect of it. like, And these niggas now, that whole thing about diamonds and the cold. Because yes. that man ended up turning into a diamond. And a majority. So majority. Majority. Yeah, like, majority. I mean, and if you was numerically, statistically speaking, I'm talking about oh. maybe 90% of your friend base you had. Yeah, yeah, 90 yeah. 90%. Yeah, yeah. I'm about to are, are fucking losers. Are fucking L7s. L7s. Fucking L7s. <laughs> <L7s. laughs> we need fucking losers. We need yeah, fucking L7s. Yeah. And begging for... Oh, shout out to the Sandlot. <laughs> <laughs> and begging for handouts, too. Like, literally. And didn't, and didn't take... Did not take... The game. Did not take the game and did not, did not grow from the hard times or the struggles. Right. Like, literally just... Like sitting in their own yeah. shit right now, thinking that the world deserves to get them a handout. Literally, and, and then, fuck like, out of yeah. here. So, so more or less being like a product. I mean, like, cause it, it, but it's, they weren't even a product it's, it's, of their so, environment. Yeah, their well, environment was so great. Yeah, that's why. Yeah, I don't yeah, even I want to name to, drop. I, I was trying to go that way. No, I know one of his friends' that. houses was. It was probably one of the nicest houses I walked in. What did I say when I walked Dude, in that like, house? What the hell? You I was live here? Like, you live here? This ain't nigga. This ain't no HGTV. Beautiful house, man. We grew up around all type of different adversities. It was ten of us in the two. A, ten bedroom. of us in a two bedroom on St. Clair. Yeah. Ten of us in a two bedroom and was happier than a pig and, and shit. And we had two dogs. And we had two dogs. <laughs> Zeus in ten trouble. No, Zeus and Debo. Zeus, Zeus yeah. and Debo. He ten of us in a two bedroom house, happier than a pig and shit. Literally. And then you got this fucking kid who's up in Shaker in a five bedroom, three and a half bathroom, and he wants to go hang with the killers and the drug dealers and the rappers and the trappers and the, the kidnappers. And the <laughs> Nigga, we fought to get out of that shit, and you want to come to this you shit. To come to you fucking idiot. Yeah. Kill yourself. I'll pay for your funeral. Yeah. Piece of shit. And then, <laughs> me, I mean, me, I mean, and even what going with that. I, I ain't gonna say that I grew up in a, a bad, bad environment, whatever. I, I'm actually one of these spoiled guys, whatever, and stuff. I, I've been spoiled as a kid, and and so I try to make myself the same way and try to teach my, or not teach my kids, but 
Even though I do work hard, like the f- first and foremost, I, I do I do work hard. <clears throat> Absolutely, this nigga is lying. He's a I, I, fucking I Mexican. Thing. <laughs> <laughs> I like nine jobs. I work, <laughs> I, I, I work. I work very hard, but like going like as far as my upbringing, like I have a, I have a lot of guys that didn't have as much as I had, or um, like my my spot was a spot to you know like to be to to, to be at. You know what I'm saying? Like and, yeah. and 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 but what I did do or what I do do to these to these um to this day or whatever I, I like having people to come to my home or whatever and i make the best of it i, I ain't gonna say sure. i had the best fucking house or whatever and shit at, at times like i ain't had no shit I, I i had a fucking basically a bando that i bought you know what i mean or not bought but that i rented out you know what i'm saying for my house or whatever so i ain't never it ain't like it's always was good but um but i always made sure that i just like the camaraderie and like the the, the the family ship and seeing and try to show um, guys, and e- e- even when I'm trying to sh- when I'm trying sh- when I'm trying to show someone, they teaching me something else, i.e. tone. You know what I'm saying? Like, yo, it- it's so much that I learned from him, but we was on the same level. But it, it was so much that I learned from him. You know what I'm saying? Like that. Sure. That's through- throughout the years that we've been that we've been um, rocking with each other and stuff. And then, like I said, going back to, well, not even going back, but like we we'll had talk about this real quick. Um, when I first met him at beat or whatever and shit, you know what I'm saying? He like, what's happening? I'm, I'm like, shit, I'm good. What's happening? You know what I'm saying? Like, cause I'm already in food. He already in food, so easy money. He like, shit, this is easy money. What's up? My name's Tom. I'm like, shit, I'm Joe. Boom, boom. Kept moving. You know what I'm saying? Like, we, we we kept it moving. Got to working. For sure. And then one of the only two that food. could actually work right, and exactly. talk at the and same dude, time. Exactly. <laughs> the two bubble gum and tie my shoes. <laughs> right. And then so 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 we so we fast forward fast so fast forward like a couple months or whatever. This that and that, so then he like shit pull up, the old the old house. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back, <laughs> you know what I'm back like, in so the day. never, yeah. So so never, like uh, to this day, never. Uh, he had nobody over his house or whatever, especially yeah. like from work or whatever and shit. So we pull up. When I pull up, meet your mother. But I knew your mother because I went to school with your mother. Uh, <laughs> nigga, like that's your sister. Like, so, hey, look, right, you know I'm how like, you know how I am. <laughs> I'm like, nigga, yeah, that's bitch, my sister. Nigga. Right? Like, you know, they be talking this shit, so <laughs> they talking all crazy. So like, I'm, I'm like, oh, yeah. I'm like, oh, yo, in order to respect what I'm about to say now, I'm, I'm, I'm like, I'm like, oh shit, man, we went to school. I'm like, she's about a grade or two in front of me. Um, but I'm, I'm like, oh man, she was the, like, she, she was a sweetheart. You know what I'm saying? Popular, she's she, 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 popular, popular, cute, uh, young, young lady or whatnot. You know what I mean? And so, so that, so, but all all that stuff went together, and um, and wait, look, wait, wait, and good. segue. Good. I told a nigga to pull up. We watched that Mike Tyson oh, special. Yeah, 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 oh yeah, 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 yeah. Please yeah, do go yes. watch it if you HBO. have never. HBO. That's HBO. it. Was classic that's <laughs> to so this day. Hey, and hot boxing is out. His joint hot boxing. That shit is dope. Yeah, but like, yeah, 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 yep, yep. You yep. got me, you got me hip to that. And yes, then, sir. Like, and then my my wife, my wife, it came over, and you know, what I'm saying like, and yep. came through or whatever, and then. That, that, that's where, that's why we you and Nick, now, you, you and Nick was. I don't even think our mom was there. You and Nick was there when I signed the papers for the for the other oh, oh, spot when yeah, I bought yeah, the spot. Yeah, you bought the spot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. You wasn't even at home. You, 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 you called me. No, he wasn't there. No, you had called me. You had called me. You, you like yo, the, you, you like uh, lady about to pull up, but mom and I, or you like. He said, lady about to pull up. When I bought the flash, she when, came when, to when the When he signed bank. the papers. Oh, and I signed okay, the papers, okay, and okay, okay, she yeah, I, I, shot I, I, me I the keys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah. Oh, and okay, it was okay. a Riz so, I, I, yeah. I was there for that. I remember when he, when he first told me and whatnot. And then, and then look now, you know what I'm saying? We, we, we both homeowners or whatever. Yeah. So we, uh, vehicles, Real estate is vehicles, definitely one of the end games. Oh, what? We definitely thinking about me and Armand. Yeah, me and Armand are going to eventually, hopefully, we're, no, not even hopefully, eventually, we get into the real estate game. That'll be definitely one of the end games for me. Yeah, definitely. Real estate is definitely going to be an end game because, Despite what most people feel, you are is going to need somewhere to fucking lay your head down. Right. At, so, um, it, it, oh, actually, speak, speaking upon speaking upon that, uh, hold on, let me write this. Let me write this part down. Uh, write this, let me write this down real quick because I'll be having a, like I said, I'll be having a, um, have this shit down. Um, at twenty nine, my apologies. But um, with the real estate, um, because uh, G, D, DJ Envy, DJ Envy is, he he pimping out a lot as far as that. Yeah. Um, but I did. I, I saw actually. I, I saw some one of my friends on my post on Facebook. He had said he like he like yo invest in like a say like a a six unit or whatever, and, and say that say you single or whatever. It's not like so the the one unit you live in the, the one unit you living in. Yeah. But you got the other five units, and then therefore um that that's you basically 
living, living for free. free. You living for free because exactly. it's, it's probably free. taking one unit to pay for yours. Exactly. The, the, the second unit the is paying for you, repairs. You can do. There you the go. third there you unit go. is you putting the money That's back in the was... pot to go back and invest into another property. There we go. That's and then you that. just build that. You just build it. I just, I just, I just, I just build it up. Oh yeah. I just started this morning. DJ Envy will be proud of me. I went to a couple real estate seminars. I didn't give them twenty thousand dollars. I was hearing him the other day, like the stupid motherfuckers were giving people twenty thousand right. dollars to just go hear somebody speak about real estate. That's crazy. When you could use this tool in your hand, right? To look up man, anything. And re- what a time. And, and go ahead and research what a time, what a time and to be go alive. Ahead and research, it. research that yeah, shit. Man. I mean, like, it, it, especially if it's available. If if, if you want an aspect of to where that you know, you know, like you being single, you don't you don't have no, or you you you're not having no youngins. Stuff like that, so you able to wiggle and move. Definitely, and, you know, definitely. Like you, whether you want to go state to state or it's not, you know what I mean? Like, like how I me, mean, even though we have youngest or that, but and then plus he got he got he got a more of a different type of money, uh, you know, like different type of money. Definitely, definitely. Thing or whatnot, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. yeah, but still though, it, it's it's not stopping, um, just a regular schmo Joe or whatever to right. do it if you have the right. Um, the right uh, facilities like mindset. you or him or something sure. like that and, and mindset uh, first and foremost mindset. yeah that's definitely going to be that's definitely oh, a good. but we've discussed this when you was 11 yeah we, we discussed this when he was 11 we would I sit too. there and we would fucking talk shit and I'm like we definitely going to own properties and cause I don't give a fuck about being a landlord, like I mean, yeah, yeah I'm, you you are always uh, then, always because like, me, me, you talked about this shit. Yeah, very you, passionate you, you, about. You, you, real you was always talking about getting um getting a store and shit, like doing yeah. the store thing. Definitely. Yep, like, I wanted to, and I, I still entertain that, that like, thought about that when that's the, right the, around the, the corner shit. from us. Yeah. But the dynamic of that neighborhood has changed so much. Like it ain't nobody there. Yeah, that it's like old people and everything. Which I'm a, I ain't a, I'm not not a fan of older people, but they're more. The dynamic with them is more so you being able to bring a product or service to them, right, 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 not right. for them to come to you to get the service. Right. So I don't know. I was very passionate about that for a little while, but it's in the it's in the works. Oh, no, it's definitely. in the works. It's definitely an end game. In, a, in addition to that, uh, I, I want to make another comment. The idea, like trades, you know, like I think a lot of a lot of people, I think a lot of people are neglecting things that provides them the opportunity to be their own boss. You know, well, when, when you say trades, um, what, 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 are, what are you saying? Oh, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, freaking, that, you that, know, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna let you finish yeah. that, and I'm, 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 a, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a caveat off, off of yours. Absolutely, go, go, go ahead, you feel go ahead, me? Ahead, there's, ahead. there's, there's a lot of people who think their options are, are extremely limited. Don't get me wrong, a lot of people's options are limited, but I think a lot of people aren't, aren't, aren't really looking at all their options. You know, uh, like freaking you know like i said engineering landscaping freaking electrician mechanics. uh mechanics so like, many things literally me myself you know uh i'm actually a licensed life insurance agent you know Gosh. and it allows me to you know not only educate people on how they can do 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 things different play a different game because mm-hmm. at the end of the day we we're playing a different game than like the millionaires and people who, who and don't we're losing and we're losing and we're losing, we're losing. Gotcha. you feel me Fucking so, warriors this season did, 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 did you, you, you want to touch shut up do you, uh, do you want to t- no, shut up with my warriors, man. <laughs> <laughs> man, these guys ain't looking good. Do you, you want to? God damn it! Let's <laughs> talk about something serious, you fucker. For sure. Um, no, um, no. Um, far as far as like what you said is um that we losing and like the. Um, I mean, white the, people the, have it set up from their child from their child's birth that they're gonna be financially well off. We've in the last three years, back to back. You know how they say death comes in threes. Mm-hmm. I don't believe in that shit, but. We've I lost do. a person in our life for the last three years consecutively. Oh, yeah, I, 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 I won't go. I mean, I want Consecu- I, 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 yeah. I to kind of touch that. Yeah, but I, but consecutively. I, I didn't wanna, like, we lost my uncle in 17, that. lost my lost brother bro, bro, in 18, bro, bro. and lost my stepfather this year. Right, right. None yeah. of them had insurance. I was about to say, and, and look, yeah. looking on, on, on that basis, you feel me? A lot of people in different situations, their family dies and they're blessed. You know, they get blessings. And that's they, what they, he's talking about with winning and oh, losing. So, oh, yeah. Okay, literally, okay, you feel gotcha. me? Like, right, so that makes people sense. are leaving their, their their family with blessings. You know, we've been less, left with curses and a yeah. lot of people are. Like, it's crazy. GoFundMe. Do you know GoFundMe was started to fund small businesses? I, I did not. It's, it's crazy. That That's literally why they were started. So that, you know, People like you who like, hey, could you could you help me get my business? I want to get some more equipment for my podcast. Real shit. No, literally, you feel me? Small businesses, and now it's predominantly used to fund funerals. Deaths, Deaths, absolutely. That's that's what it's used for. Because people, we aren't we aren't proactive. You know, we're just reactive. Most people, most people aren't like, okay, yeah. 
I'm going to do this to prevent me from having a baby. And Most people that? are like, shit, this shit go, shit, I'm horny. You here, I ain't got no condom. Let's go right now. And we'll worry about it in nine months. We'll worry about, about it later. Nine we'll worry Literally. about it in nine months. You know, yeah. like. Right after my fam, one of the, my uncle passed away. You remember one of the first things I called and said to you? Maybe. I said, Armand, I got insurance. And who's the beneficiary? You are. <laughs> Armand, I got insurance. You're the beneficiary. When Absolutely. I leave, I'm leaving great gifts behind. Great gifts. Right. Great and, gifts and behind. That, that, that's, that, that, that's how we set up. Um, that's how we set up. And, and like, I mean, I hate to, hate to say I knock it, but I do knock it. Uh, going back to the GoFundMe and stuff, like, you know, when... Cause people don't think about if a if a if a little five year old get gunned. I'm like, we we don't want that or whatever. But it's, it's but, possible, but, but, but but start but start out the gate. You should. I mean, or I ain't gonna say you should. I can't tell nobody how to. You know what I'm saying? Do they um their money and stuff? But as you were saying, like we make sure we we make sure of it of with the insurances or whatever. You know what I mean? Like that. that that's one of the biggest things because you don't know when the shit is going to happen. Absolutely. You don't know. As soon as you walk up outside, shit, it, it don't matter if this goddamn house burning down right now. Literally. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like this house right here, right now, that motherfucking goddamn, the power went out fucking earlier today and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, hey, who the fuck knows how that happened? But you see, that's mean? the so, difference when, when he said they was winning because they're raising yeah. their children from birth knowing and, and it's that great grandma there. is leaving great gifts right, and right, right. great granddad left grandma so the house. They, they, so the houses get carried over. Generational wealth always oh, see, regenerates and get wealth. carried yeah, over. Sure. So all they do is keep building on top of building on top of building. All and, we're doing is losing and destroying. In addition, right. in addition to them playing a different game and winning that game, you know, people people are curious. Is like, how 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 is Donald Trump evading his taxes? It's because his money is in different places that isn't taxed. Right. Like life insurance, life insurance isn't taxed, you right. know. And there's actual portfolios that you can get that literally saves you money. So you're saving money, and unlike a 401k, money that is taxed, this money is completely untaxed. And literally, it's crazy because most people don't know how how taxes even work, you know. Like most people, are like, hey, yeah. we're gonna go I file def- our I taxes and 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 get our little ends, you know. And That's you know how with me and you talk I, about I, it. All I, I you did don't. was lend the government your money with no interest, and he borrowed it from you, and then just gave it back to you. Literally. Right. That's what taxes are. Taxes was originally funded for wars. We didn't even have to pay taxes when America was first founded. We didn't pay taxes, and then they started they started going to war, and they were like, well, we gotta get somebody to pay for these wars. They start taxing our dumb asses. Mm. It's horrible. It's a way that you can set up your tax bracket as far as your exemptions go to where you, me and the government are almost even every year. I might owe them $200 because I get my money during the year. I don't want you to borrow my money all year and then hand it back to me like you're giving me a gift. It was my money to begin with, motherfucker. She is shit. Nello? Hey, well, y'all, y'all, hey, well, y'all, t- hey, y'all teach all right. <laughs> See, I'm quiet. Hey, no stress. I, 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 uh, it's a real spill. It's a whole other way. It's a whole other way. Yeah, nah, it's nah, it's a whole other way. If I if I don't know about shit, like you you, you know me better, than, or most uh, you know me better than most most of anybody. Like if I don't know, I either ask a question or or you do the sponge. I, 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 I shut the fuck up. I shut the fuck up, and then I ask I ask that question. You know what I mean? So like. So that, 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 that's definitely a good little thing. Like, I, I, I wish Girlie was a. Uh, oh, she's here now. I'm about to say because uh, she she would have loved to uh, talk about that. <clears throat> um, but uh, no, dude, man, I I, I, I mean, we ain't even cutting off right now. But uh, I, pre- I mean, I appreciate y'all uh, like coming on and whatnot. And I do have one question because please hit me with it. Oh, matter of fact, before I say that, oh, I'm, 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 I'm gonna say I'm gonna say what my wife said. Uh, my wife said uh, when you came over before you passed out and. Yeah, after, 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 <laughs> but no, she she said that she was a very um, it, it was a very very dope compliment. But we, me and him, know what it is. But um, she said that she was very articulate, very um, respectful, absolutely, very, something like that. But and she she like she was like she like our mind's very uh, well spoken. Uh, that, well that was spoken. the key word, well spoken. Uh, that was that was the word, well spoken and whatnot. I'm, I'm, like, I'm like man, he always been like that. Like, he always, he always and as we know, that. he didn't get that shit from me. <laughs> 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 Clearly, Obviously you didn't get it from you, motherfucker. Fuck. <laughs> right, like, you, right, you fucker. God damn, I, th- I, th- I think we uh, messing with him now, right there. Cause cussing so much. <laughs> hey, I even be, hey, but look, and it's genuinely who I am. Though always been, I be at work cussing motherfuckers. Like, Tone. <laughs> no, oh no, oh, you, well, you already know how we always talk about yeah, at that's work. That's a whole other like, podcast. Right, <laughs> that's right, a whole other one. We go on that. 